guide wires in place. I'm preparing to deliver the valve. Okay, you, you have to stop. If that valve goes through... Get out of here, Murphy. No, if that valve goes through, he'll die. I Call thought security. it was an aortic dissection, but I was wrong. The cold feet are from a coarctation. No, 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 it's too close. You're too close. Stop, 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 please, stop. BB spiking 200 over 100, heart rate's up. He's gonna stroke. Give him nitro and cardine. Pulling out. BP's dropping. He's starting to stabilize. Dr. Murphy, go on. Dr. Nakano did not make a mistake in the bypass. He did everything right. But Mr. Hill has a congenital narrowing of the abdominal aorta. He's had that correctation for years, but never knew because his body compensated for the poor circulation by raising his blood pressure, which caused his heart to deteriorate, requiring a bypass. The stronger repaired heart put pressure on the valve and his blood pressure dropped. No more compensation. His feet got cold. And I could get the guide wire up there, but the valve delivery system would be too big to fit through the coarctation without damaging the vessel. Yes. We'll have to open him up. And the valve will have to be replaced directly through surgery. I hope you'll join us for that. Valve placed, leaflets mobile. New valve is perfectly seated in the annulus. No regurgitation flow in both coronary arteries. I'm about to close up. Looks like we've got a paravalvular leak. We need to go back and fix this. Irrigate and check the image. No leak. Slight excess from the washing jets in the mechanical valve. Normal finding. Oh. oh, you're very good. I think he knows that. Still nice to hear. Closing up now. 2-0 vicral suture. There's a patient admitted this morning I think you should see. You thinking of Mrs. Cavanaugh? It's a good idea, Dr. Park. We'd welcome another take as to whether she's a good candidate for inserting an ICD. I'll consult just on that question if you'd like me to. But I won't join in the OR. I'm quitting surgery. I don't understand. When did you decide? 15 minutes ago. I nearly closed up without doing a final antibiotic lavage. But you didn't. Nurse Barker prompted you with a syringe. It was a tiny error. There was no contamination of the field. Many surgeons don't even do a final lavage. I always told myself once I started making tiny errors, I'd stop before I made a big one. Paul, we almost lost a patient today. You were still rattled. Thank you, Marcus. But I made this plan years ago because I knew that when the time came, I'd look for reasons why whatever I did wrong was tiny, minor, didn't count. That's when I made the rule. Everything counts. Dr. Murphy, it was nice sewing with you.
actually pretty outside the campground. Another half mile and we can see the lake. You're really cute. Let me take a picture. Go stand on that log. I'll get you from a low angle, a hero angle, because you're my hero. <laughs> Okay. Okay, I smidge to the left. Ah! Ah! Oh! Sean! Are you okay? Oh my God, you are not okay. Okay, on the count of three, mm -hmm. ready? One, two. Ah! 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 You were supposed to wait until I got to three. I know, but in the movies, they always go early to catch you off guard. You don't need the element of surprise to reduce a dislocated ankle. Okay, but did it work? Yes, you, you relocated it correctly. Damn. But. My toes are still dusky and numb. The posterior tibial artery is torn. I thought it was just pinched. If circulation isn't restored, I'll have permanent tissue damage, maybe even have to have my foot amputated. This is not a problem. I can run to where I can get a cell signal and call 911. Uh, it'll take at least two hours for you to run back to the campground. I'm faster than I look. You told me you used to skip phys ed class because you hated running. I can hate it and still be good at it. No. My pocket knife is as sharp as a scalpel. The tent repair kit has nylon thread and you can use a fish hook as a suturing needle. You are obviously delirious because there's no way in hell I'm doing surgery. It's not a complicated procedure. For a surgeon, which I'm not! I'll guide you step by step, okay? It'll just take two sutures. I've seen you hem your pants. An artery is not a pair of jeans! There's a bottle of tequila in my backpack. You'll need to sterilize the incision, and I will need anesthesia. Sean, I... Tequila! Stat! Okay, careful with that anesthesia. I need you coherent enough to guide me through this. Don't worry. I've calculated the proper dosage. N no, no, not like that. The scalpel goes on the left of the tray, sponges on the right, needle driver, and sutures in the middle. Okay, got it. Okay. I might suggest no barking instructions at me. I'm freaked out enough already. I'll do my best. But even with the tequila, when you cut into my ankle, I'll be in extreme pain, which can cause irritability. I can't do this. You have to. The worst that could happen is you mess it up and cause permanent damage to my foot, which is exactly what will happen if you don't do it. Okay. Tequila, stat. Okay, tighten the tourniquet and then use a sponge to clear the blood. Okay. It's clearing up. You should be able to see. I see it, and the leaking hole. Now you just need to use the needle driver to sew the edges together. Be careful not. Be careful not to what? Sean. Put the backpack under my head. How's that gonna help with your ankle? It won't, but I'm about to lose consciousness from blood loss and I don't want dirt in my... Sean. 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 